We want to get back to more news now. A rural Pottawatomie County family had their dog shot to death by their neighbor, but the sheriff says no one broke the law. And John Chapman reports it's a very sad story on both sides, and they say they wished it never happened. This is Skye, a two-year-old husky. People who live out here in rural Pottawatomie County tell us that Skye gets away from her owners quite often. Last week, the dog got away again. The dog's owner, Michelle Young, found her dog. Sky was dead. She was shot twice in the back of the head and then dumped in a ditch. It was really gruesome. Um, we're just all really sad. Michelle says the people who shot her dog were familiar with the animal. She had been there twice before and they watered her and when it was raining, put her in their barn or their garage. The neighbors who shot the dog say they were in a bad situation and they did not want to shoot the dog. The neighbors say this time was different. Sky would not stop. They could not get her to respond and she was putting their livestock in danger. They had no other choice but to shoot. Nobody wants to see a, a pet, you know, get, uh, get killed, but Again, they have to be responsible for their animals. If they have a pet that's, uh, you can't just let them run loose out on, you know, even though it's in the country, you, you just can't let them run loose. No one was cited in this incident, and both sides are sorry that it happened. But officials say out here in rural Iowa, you have to control your pets because property owners have the right to protect their livestock. Michelle and her family are still heartbroken. And just the manner of her death makes it just that worse, that much worse, 10 times worse. The woulda, the shoulda, the coulda, why? You know, it's just, I just, and I can't wrap my head around it. I've tried and I can't wrap my head around it whatsoever. It's completely senseless. With photographer Joe Benami, John Chapman, WOWT 6 News. Pottawatomie County Sheriff Jeff Danker says they have had cases before where someone's dog gets loose and harms or even kills a neighbor's livestock.